I think meetings like this are increasingly important, particularly from an education perspective. The, the most important data is always presented at the biggest international meetings and it's increasingly difficult for people to get there. So the, the role of a meeting like this is to distill the important practice changing trial information and present it to an audience in a way that's easy for them to access. So that's very important. I've just been at the session where uh, I was, I was presenting the, the Abrutinib data, but also that session with the, very much the practice changing abstracts from ASH, all at the same time. If you wanted to see those abstracts at ASH, you'd have to be running all over the building. So distilling that in a format that's valuable for you know, all of us is, is really useful. And I think embracing digital technology, uh, having education in different ways, in bite-sized chunks that people can access easily. It's increasingly difficult for people to get to meetings like this. One of the things that BSH has struggled with really is engaging with non-doctors, particularly the nurses, and I think we have to think of ways where we can target education for their needs in a way that's accessible for them, which doesn't mean they have to come to this meeting and sit in the same sessions. Uh, so I think we have to think about that in a different way and I think social media again has a role there. I'm sitting in this session, Graham Collins has tweeted what I've presented before I've even sat down so, and that's been retweeted already so I'm not of that generation but you can see how quickly that information moves. So again, and, and BSH are onto this, uh, um, I think we need to embrace these things and just help educate people in a, in a different way, in a, in a slicker way, really. And, and if I can help do that, then I think that's what my, partly what my role is.